This is Coyote News. With Easter break quickly approaching, Coyote News' Ali Boysen is joining us live from the muck with the pastor of the Newman Center, Jeffrey Norfolk, to talk about some options for celebrating the holiday. Allie? Thanks, Lauren. As students prepare to leave for the holiday weekend, the St. Thomas Newman Center is preparing to welcome people. I'm here with Father Jeff to discuss the details. Father Jeff, what activities is the Newman Center putting on this weekend for students? So the primary activity is Sunday at 11 o'clock. We have our normal mass times. Uh, the unique thing about this Sunday is that one of our students is being baptized. So grew up in a Christian environment, but never in the Catholic faith. And so he'll be baptized, receive the sacrament of confirmation, I have a little reception after Mass as well. Uh, many of the students are gone for this uh, weekend, so we know that there's not a lot that will be around campus, but at 11 o'clock uh, will be the primary celebration and the reception after Mass. Do you work with other religious organizations on campus during weekends that have multiple holidays like Easter and Passover this weekend? Uh, we don't work necessarily with Jews when you mention Passover. Uh, we know that they have a group on campus. It's my understanding they'll have a Seder meal at some point. Uh, but we don't have any particular interaction with them. Uh, other Christian organizations, yes, uh, we'll do, uh, at times we've done a praise and worship where we've invited other Christians to come and gather. Nothing this weekend in particular. Yeah. So what is available for students that aren't necessarily Christian or what might interest them? Sure, uh, they can always come to the building. Uh, the Newman Center is locally across the street from the Muck and the Law School, and they can study there. They're welcome to come to the, the meal on Sunday after our, our mass time. Uh, and we have non-religious events in the sense of dodgeball, a dance, uh, activities where they're welcome to come in in that sense. Uh, we have a lower lounge that has a TV, a ping pong table. All right. Thank you, Father Jeff. You're welcome. For more information, you can check out the USD St. Thomas More Center for more information on what's going on this weekend. Live re reporting live from the muck for Coyote News, I'm Allie Boyson.